Ladies and gentlemen, I have with us Mr. Daryl. Mr. Daryl is a very well-known stakeholder in the world of radio. How are you doing today, Mr. Daryl? I'm doing really well, thanks, Joshua. Can you tell us more about what you do? Um, I'm the founder and festival director of the International Radio Festival, the world's largest on-air event. Awesome. How many listeners do you get to that? Well, each edition reaches at least 100 million. Yes. Amazing. So how do you find uh, the, the Saudi future of the media exhibition? Fomex. I'm absolutely amazed. I'm amazed by the country, number one, and uh, that all this is going on, and that radio, <coughs> excuse me, radio is so prominent, uh, because, you know, we celebrate at the radio festival the two most important people in radio. That's the anchor and the producer. That's what radio is. It's a, it's a daily discussion. It's the it's a most human form of media. So that's it's like a tango. We, but yeah, that's right. That's why we're pleased to be here. <laughs> so what do you think about your visit? Were you expecting... Uh, all of this interest and enthusiasm in the future of media of Saudi Arabia? Um, it doesn't surprise me, to be honest. I'm just really amazed to see that it's taking place here, which, which says a lot about where this country wants to go. What about the future of radio? A lot of people have moved on to social media, television. Uh, they moved on to different types of channels and platforms. What is the future of radio looking like to you? Well, I think there's a... Uh, I know. There's an incredible radio renaissance which is taking place and which we're going to realize. Because exactly as you said, you know, in this over-digitalized, hyper-speed, content, 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 we're human. We have a human uh, momentum. And listening, you can only listen to so and so much in a second. And we do that naturally. And that's why radio is going to trump. Radio is going to go from the world's um, global medium, uh, instant news, to the world's quality medium, impact because most media doesn't have any impact. It's just bombarding us. But what you and I are doing is the real storytelling. So radio is in the right place right now. Tell me, what's your favorite radio station in Saudi Arabia? Uh, I think it's something called the Lula FM, to be honest. I've been, I've been stalking you, I told you in Davos. Yeah, I've been stalking, you've been watching, I think you do a really amazing job. It's fresh, it's impactful, and of course you've got access to some, some great uh, um, interviewing partners, such as myself, I would say, um, and also others, and, um, you know... Lots of self-embellishment on the radio. Say again? Lots of self-embellishment on the radio. Absolutely, you know, and, you know, a radio is also the most visual of all media. Everything we hear, we turn into pictures, and we always turn into a good picture, don't Absolutely, we? Yeah. So it's pleasing all the people all the time. Thank you so much, for thank you so much, Daryl, for your time. Thank you, Joshua. Alola FM. The sound of Arabia.